Okay, what we're going to do today is show you how to set up your easy camera. Um, you may have gotten it from any website on the internet today. It's a simple pan and tilt camera with night vision. It's one of these cameras, looks similar to this. And what we're going to do when you go to easynetworkcam.com, you may want to print these instructions first. It's a PDF with easy step-by-step -step instructions with illustrations on how to set up your camera. You may want to print these and follow along here today. But right now I'm going to show you on my computer. We want to first uh, plug in or screw in the antenna. Please note this nut here has to be tight before you start screwing the antenna in. Uh, please take a pair of needle nose pliers or whatever if you see that it's loose and just snug it up and then screw your antenna in here, your wireless antenna. Then you'll want to plug in a network cable that's coming from your router, one of your empty router ports. Plug it in. This is just used to set it up. After that we can make it wireless. And then plug in your power cord finally. Okay, what we're going to do now is download this uh, IPCAM setup software. I'm just going to run it right from my website. Choose run. It's a small program, so uh, click next and next uh, setup information. Yep. Okay, and it's downloaded to our computer in our programs file. Okay, so we're going to shut this out for now. Uh, no, I'm going to restart later. I know this will work. Close and we'll minimize this. Okay, here's our camera, IP camera tool. What we're going to do is double click on this and it's going to cycle every minute and you see some of my cameras I already have named and set up. Well this anonymous one that has come in here uh, is the new camera. Your camera it's always named anonymous until you address it a name. So I'm going to uh, click on here I can highlight it see. If I right click after I've highlighted it I can go to the network configuration and take a look at that there. Uh, but what I'm going to do is double click here. Well, oh, it's cycled around. We'll wait for it to come back. Because when you click on it and then uh, click off, it cycles the camera on and off. It'll come back on here within 30 seconds or less. This program just cycles it. Okay, now we're going to double click it now. The username when you first get your camera is always admin lowercase admin with no password. We're going to click OK. You're going to get to the software mode of the camera and uh, as long as you're work, uh, working with IE browsers uh, you're going to want to choose this top sign in. So I chose that and there we have picture it's as simple as that as far as getting it connected and if I want to try to move it around if you find that uh, when you log in here first and you you're getting a blurry picture please don't panic it's not the quality of the camera it's just the lens and the lens has a uh, adjustable dial here around the lens and you can tighten this or loosen this adjustable dial to tune it right in to uh, a crisp clear picture and you can always go to administrator here's all where you set up your settings to mail say for instance you can set this up if you want to mail a uh, picture to you when it picks up motion you've got your uh, user settings here you can address uh, new users to log in. You can make them just be a visitor with no controls. You can have them uh, be an operator where they can actually uh, motion the camera. They can move the camera or the administrator you want to always keep as yourself. And you can go back here. They also have a view here under visitor where you can view up to three other cameras besides the one you're on now. So that's all for today. I uh, hope to see you again soon. Bye now.